All right. How about now? Hopefully it won't drop this time. I just, I really want that ATVC um, encoding so I can like squish space. Because, you know, I keep making content, none of the content goes away. Anyways, it's like hot as shit, so I'm not gonna turn on my, uh... V-Roid! Why am I not a Sprout? Well, we're gonna play Pups and Purrs Animal Hospital. So, keep it in with the spirit of pets and things. Um... Got bees in it! Uh, I hope the, uh... Captions are working. I'm trying to pull up my thing on mobile. You gonna play? So I hope there's, um, in the bottom, the bottom right. Right? Right, yeah. Should be bottom right corner, there should be a little tiny uh, CC and a tiny little Twitch blurb. That's that's the new um, card, card captions, yes. Card captions Sakura. That I'm gonna be transitioning to. Uh... Okay, that's broke. Anyways, I would... I, I'm... Let's go to my Twitch dashboard. No, that's not it. Where's my dashboard? Yes, I am alive. Um, well, I can't- I can't see it on the main thing. God damn, there's too much shit popping- okay, there it is. Captions appear to be, uh... On? Although my captions... Look like ass. I like to- I like to put it on Seraph. Presets... Uh... Seraph... Outline... Transition background. Yeah, you can, like, set up your stuff there and then you can have Twitch completely just ignore any settings that you've set for it. Like, how big it is and all that stuff. It's, that's always, um... It's always good. Anyway. That's what I'm going to be using from, from now on. Uh, hopefully it's good. Uh, I know I could be using a web captioner, like I usually do, where it puts it on the screen. But, um... I guess I'm being selfish and I just want more screen real estate, so I kind of maybe possibly want to uh, take out that little text box on the bottom. Anyway, that intro music was from Radiant Tail, and it Radiant Tail's music is so damn good. Um, It's a really good- well, so far I've been enjoying it. It's just a really nice, refreshing Otome game. Um... Uh, like... It's a breath of fresh air, it's a fantasy, it's got... The, the artwork is fantastic! Uh, Axis Games decided to fuck up the font again, but that's Axis Games for ya. Um... And 
it's like set a fantasy world, and there's there's fae, there's dragons. Uh, the story seems to be lighthearted. I mean, there's some dark tones to it, but it seems to be it's going to be more lighthearted than like Yo Fiore, uh, Color X Malice. Even I uh, could realize had a dark tone to it. This seems to be like more lighthearted. I haven't seen too too much darkness yet. Like, you know, like the world's ending or bad shit happens to the main character. Anyway, uh switch to 16 by 9. Wait a minute. Switch? Oh god damn it. I think Rujiks just crashed. Or not. Anyway, let's let's continue what we were doing. I don't remember what we were doing. We were taking care of stuff and buying clothes. But Radiant Tail, good good Atome game so far. I don't hate any of the characters that you can go for, but I do have my favorites. Eon's first, Pascalia is gonna be next. Vilio, I think's in the middle. Zephora is next to last, and then Gen Genia is um definitely last. I don't I just I just don't like that kind of character. I also found out that Eon's voice actor is shared with um Hamiyama from Shin Sakutai. He's really quiet. I think your dog is dead. Um who do I wanna go after? I don't even like I said, I don't remember what I'm doing here. Let's run to the office. Oh, I think I was going after the blue one. Dokashimasta. Is is this a, is this how you romance people? You just show up and be like, uh, tell me about yourself. No, no, tell me about- oh, damn. Somebody's gonna have to tell me if I go offline because, well, um, my thing that's supposed to be working isn't working. まずは連絡がありますI should note that, um, Pups and Purrs, I think, Pet Shop is coming out? 
So if this is like your your thing, like you like this these kind of games. There's, there's one, the Pups and Purs um, Pet Shop's coming out. Hey Jamie, yeah, it's been a while. I've been every time I wanted to stream, I've been just a melted mess on in the on the ground. But I just felt like I just need to start streaming again and like force myself to have a schedule. Ugh, schedules. But yeah, pops of person. Ah, uh, blah, blah, blah. Pet shop. Yeah, pet shop's coming out. We're playing Animal Hospital, which is a continuation of the one of the pets. Pet shop. From Ubisoft, like way back in the day when they were just like, oh, like I was talking last time, there were lots, uh, licensing lots of just animal games and putting it in their pets line, which then Axis Games uh, <laughs> licensed this one, which is it is a continuation. So, ah. Uh, I hate it when computers fry on you. I uh, hopefully it's nothing big. Hopefully it's easily to re replace and cheap to replace. Skykatawa,その時に詳しく説明しますが、新しい道具を使えばより多くの病気や怪我を見つけられるようになるので。I'm looking for the one guy that's looking at it to tell me what's wrong with it. Good luck with that. Usually, well, I guess I, I sort of diagnose my own. You just open it up and like sniff the little parts and whichever one smells the most burnt, that's probably the problem. Usually it's uh, power supplies that go out. Oh yeah, I had a computer fried by a power thunderstorm before. I I know exactly that feeling. I was devastated. And it fried some of my hard drives too, so I actually lost data. I had like a whole RPG Maker game I was making and it was going good. And it, it, it gone. So... If you have a tiny bit of money, after you get it fixed, a tiny bit of money lying around, well, maybe not a tiny bit, but like $70, I would get a uh, UPS, a uninterrupted power supply, uh, cyber power makes them, APC makes them, uh, check for your wattage, get one of those. Um, not only does it act as like a battery backup for when the power goes out, it's a... It's a surge protector, like a really good surge protector, and not like the surge protectors, it, the strips you buy that say they're surge protectors, but then your computer magically ends up fried anyways. Because it'll like, it'll fry the battery inside the UPS first before your computer, which the, the battery, it's just a, like a $20, $30 replacement. Your computer could cost a lot. Oh, so it's connected to my one PC that right now used to be with my big one. Yeah, hopefully none of your hard drives are are aced. Hopefully it's just the power supply that just, when it got zapped, it died. Because the power supply, you just put a new one in there and then the computer's just ready, good to go. If it's a motherboard, then you have to do work on it. In my case, it fried the motherboard itself. So... Oh, the, uh, the processor, yeah. If your processor gets zapped, that's, that's, that's a lot of money. But if it's only if it's the if the motherboard's completely fine and it's only the chip, then you only have to replace the chip. 
Replacing an entire motherboard is just a hassle. If it's a chip, you just swap the chip out. And then you're good to go. If it's a motherboard, you have to take everything out. Have to probably get a new chip for the motherboard because, like, the, the old motherboard you had, they don't make them anymore and they probably don't make the chips that go on them. And you have to put everything back in, and, then you, and you hope the new motherboard has all the bits and bobs that the old one did. The guy is a friend to my boyfriend's mother, so I can actually- that's good. Like, sometimes computer people are a bit untrustworthy. I think we're gonna date Konami just because I forgot who I was dating. I think it was either the blue or the purple one. Oh, yeah, he's the para, para veterinarian. Para I just don't like the Genki guy types. There's nothing bad with them. Like, I'm playing John, John and Orimaki is a pretty cute Genki guy. But, and it's just not my cup of tea. Yuma or Konami is more my cup of tea. Nan demo shirze. I just streamed with my other computer but was lagging, but that was where they upgraded the internet in the building. I wish they upgraded the internet in this building. We don't have fiber here because of reasons. So our internet is just pure, um... Cable. I live in a house that has four apartments in it. Yeah, I live in an apartment complex, so we have to do whatever the apartment complex has decreed, which is we they've sold out the Comcast, so we can't get Verizon. Dobutsno Koto Nitsuite, Dekiru Kagiri o Shemas no de Gimon Gareba Kite Kudasai. Oh, yeah, you might you win someone. I don't really like the Fox type characters. But you know, their eyes are always closed and they're always kind of... So For starters, be sure to give the little lint balls your undivided attention during the exam. So that's cute. Little lint balls. Spectrum, I've heard things about Spectrum. None of them have been good. But then again, one internet provider in the United States is actually good. They know they have a monopoly over wherever they are, and they know they can do whatever, and you really can't do anything. What are you gonna do? Switch? <laughs> good luck with that. <laughs> Is the, is the stream cropped at the bottom? Looking at my phone, it looks like my stream is cropped. Maybe not. Maybe it's just that the rotation on this is weird. There it goes. I highly doubt Konami is going to be the fox type because this is a simple little pet game. I don't, and I don't, I doubt their personalities are going to be deeper than a puddle. Luffy Bull, Juju and Leon, and I am taking a bulldog named Muffin. お願いしますね。I 
think I was the exam three. What color was that? Was that red? Yes. Most of these games, the, um... The dating part's actually really easy, and it's, and it's just keep going out with the guy, or focusing your attention on the guy. And... and it'll work out. Like, I did that for Princess Debut, and supposedly the hardest character to get in the game I... I got... first... first time. Everything worked better than expected. First time, uh, perfect. Yeah, I'm stealing uh, Lumi's name. Part of Lumi's name. Cause it's cool. I could use motion controls because I have a PS4 controller. I don't think I really want to set it up or test it. Yeah, this is on the Switch. So if you were playing this on an actual Switch, you could pick the whole Switch up and, and do it that way. I don't have a capture card, so I can't actually use my Switch. So instead, I, uh, uh I, I use other methods of, of streaming this wonderful game to your, to your eyeballs. Told me which leg they were limping on. Too cold. Yeah. I have a white, I think that's generation one PS4 controller. I got it for like 30 bucks because apparently I guess it's the um the, the first generation and they had the new generation in there. Works good enough. I like the ability to set up different profiles for like when I want to use the uh, Switch layout, Nintendo layout, and old school uh, Japanese PlayStation layout for video games instead of the Microsoft layout. Eat lunch with me. But lunch! Food! Mm. 
Well, I guess we're eating it. That was this guy. I guess purple it is. That's cool. I like the look of the PS5 game pads with like the clear buttons and stuff. It looks really cool. A pity that the PS5 like game pads cost seven dollars, and it's like, do you want a video game or do you want a controller? And I remember back in the day when like controllers didn't get over like thirty dollars. To be fair, there wasn't a lot to them, but they didn't get over thirty dollars. Cucumbers in their salad. My parents. I'm not gonna say anything about putting sausage in your salad because I put sausage in a salad. Not my thing, but I clicked on a button that puts sausage in somebody's salad. Then again, my salad that I'm eating has salami, Canadian bacon, bacon... What else? I think that's all the meats it has in it. And pepperoni. And a salad. Is it blue? supposed to know what fucking lunchbox color you have. Yeah, I'm so, I'm the type of person that just totally kills the the reason for a salad. That's I got it's a mod pizza salad. I got all the cheeses except the fake cheese. I got like I said all those meats. I got mushrooms Black olives, salt and pepper, diced tomatoes, romaine lettuce, and I'm gonna have Caesar dressing, which is like probably a lot, probably a lot more in it than the Rin Ranch. Yeah, my, my salad tastes pretty salty. They mean slow, they mean real slow. Yo, 
know, I like it. That's just the way I like my salads. But you know, lettuce with some tomato and some ranch dressing. Those are fine salads too. Just like your basic salad. Maybe put a little bit of cheese in there if you got it. It's just, to me, a perfect salad is romaine lettuce and tomatoes. I just gotta have my tomatoes in my salad. There's something about those combinations. And then, like, I usually like a cream dressing, like ranch or Caesar. Or, or ginger. Uh... Like, when I go to the Japanese, Chinese places, and they have, like, the ginger salad. But, you know, when you give me an option of, like, a salad buffet or, like, all you can eat or something, oh yeah, oh yeah. My salad's gonna look like a monster. If it seems like I'm not too focused on the game, it's, it's because my brain is just... Even simple flight, simple game tasks like this are like... My brain's just like, nope. Rin and Len, the Vocaloids? I think Teto, I think... No, not Teto. There's like a third one that's yellow that I've seen as like a new one. I can't keep up with all the new Vocaloids. I like Kaito, and that's about, that's about it. I, Kaito, Gakupo, um... Gakupoid... Uh, and Len? Yeah, I think Len's the boy. You know, I just like all the, the cute boys. But if I have to choose, like, a female Vocaloid, it's... What is it? Megure? Um, the, the one... The one with, like, the red hair, I think. Yeah, I keep getting Lin, Lin and Len mixed up because they're twins, of course, and their name is like one letter different. I think her name's Meguri. She, I think she has like the maroon red hair. Like the, the mature looking one. But those are like my my top vocal lines. But you know, Miku is just Miku. Miku is always there. I just kind of wish they had more male vocal lines. Cause it just seems that it's always a new female vocal line. It's like, don't we already have like a lot of them? I would keep, like, the balance between male and female vocaloids, like, equal. 
Like, here's the, like, Lin and Len, here's the child Vocaloids, uh, Miku, and someone more Miku's age. Um... Kaito, and was it... Me, me, the other one, the... My brain... Oh no, she wears red. She has brown hair. I'm getting her mixed up with a different character. And then there's the other one with the pink hair. Yeah, those two I like. And then Kaito, which is not the same age as... Miku, I think, but you know, having another character, Mik a male character, Miku's age, then we have the twins, then a character, I think the paint girl's age. Like, basically, you just want Vocaloids for like the vocal range. Like, you have the two kids there for like the high range, you have Miku for like the Miku range, and then like, have it's like in colors. And then, you know, you want, like, the, the, the deeper-sounding, like, voices. I forget what they're called. I think they're real something voices. But, you know, like, the deep male voice and then, like, the deep female voice. Warning! Cartoon fleas! Gakapo... And Gakapo is based off of Gak. And these fleas are so cute. But alas, they must die. At least they just kind of disappear. Yeah, Gakapo is the Gak Vocaloid. Of course his voice is deep because Gak's voice is deep. Kaito's voice, I honestly haven't really heard Kaito's actual range. They usually tend to have Kaito sing either way too high or way too low. And with a Vocaloid, that's... you don't really want your Vocaloid singing too high or too low because then it just sounds kind of... off. Which is why you need more Vocaloids to cover all those ranges that you need... range for. Miku Miku Dance. I tried to get into Miku Miku Dance and I did not understand what I was doing. As someone who... Who actually can do like model in 3D the way the, the control the 3Dness just felt not how I would control 3D or how I would pose characters using the IK uh, system. But then at the time I quit, there really wasn't anything else. It's like, it's either you learn Miku Miku Dance or you don't. I'm so glad they're telling me how to do these things again because I completely forgot. <laughs> Dunshin from Steam. I'm gonna look into it. I think I said I was looking into it before, but then I kind of... I hyper-focused on something else and I just didn't, didn't go back. But I'm playing Jack John, which has a dancing segment in it. And I'm like, hey, I kind of want to see if I can... Uh, what's the word for it? 
Coordinate. You can see my brain is melted. Coordinate. Chore choreograph. Choreograph the dancing for the dances in that one. Like, either, like, rip them from the game itself, or, you know, try to do it, do it myself. Especially, what's it, uh, how do you do, uh, something, I forget the rest of the Japanese, but it's a really nice, that's a really nice song. I'll play it at the end of, when I get done with, um... Done with this. I'll just show the video just so you can see what I'm talking about. That would just even be cooler if I can like find it just like that. But you know. I've seen a few. I've watched a few of the videos. They're pretty- they're pretty cool. I like them. Oh no, the tweezers. I hate the tweezers. Alright, tweezers, let's go. I do kind of wonder what system Shaq Sean actually uses for their dancing, because I really doubt that they just made a new engine when there's so many out there. But, uh, since it's done by Broccoli, it's probably whatever one they made for, um, Uta Pri. And I'm trying to rethink Broccoli. I know Broccoli has some other, like, singy dancing games out there. お疲れ様です。さすがですね。Sorry. Okay, let's uh spend money. Probably gonna make today. What's good is some Oh, yeah, nice.
Oh, this reminds me. Fashion Dreamer comes out in November. Why? Why do I have to wait that long for Fashion Dreamer? Like, they teased it at what, like, April? Before April? Now it's like, yeah, it's, uh, it's November, and it's like... I look forward to it. I'm hoping it's not going to be $60. I'm hoping it's not going to be $50. If it was $40... I would consider that slightly over my uh, price I would like, but uh, it's the price that $30 games use, uh, are now. But since it's Nintendo, they're probably going to slap a $60 price sticker on it, and I'm going to be like, nah, I can't. If it's $40, i will probably just pre-order it. However, if there's like a pile of DLC for it, then I'm I might I don't know what I'm gonna do. Wait for a sale. Yeah, I will definitely wait for a sale. I mean, especially if it has DLC, then I'm gonna be like, no, I'm gonna wait until the main game is rock bottom prices, which means it's probably out of its uh I target area. Well, basically, you know, there's that time that if a when the game sells, they count that towards its uh, success, like, out of that window, and then, you know, hear me buying it, like, after everybody's done with the game and moved on to the next... next best thing. But, hopefully there's not going to be any DLC. Tastes like pink. Oh boy. I love it when things taste like colors. What does it taste like? It tastes like blue. Cause then it's like, it tastes like red, and you're thinking, is it gonna be the, the garbage strawberry flavor, or is it gonna be the okay fruit punch flavor? <laughs> Do I still draw? As a matter of fact, I was planning on doing a artist stream with Pokemon uh, Art Academy. To get back into learning how to draw. Well, I wouldn't even say learning, but like banging off the rust to where like since Pokemon Art Academy has it's not really levels, but it's got tasks for you to do, you know, to go through it like it's a video game, but it's a video game in which you do art. And while the game doesn't grade you on your art. It only grades you on whether you press the, the, the end button or not. It's still one of those, like... Uh... Um... Yeah, it's one of those things, you know, you just you pace yourself. But Pokemon Art Academy and the other Art Academy games for the 3DS and the DS and the, the Wii? Wii U? Wii U. It was on the Wii U. Really good games. Really, re well, really good drawing... drawing things. Like, if you screw it up, 
you just can start over that easy. No one's gonna judge you. And the fact that, like, the media you work with, they limit it in such a way that you're not confused about all your options. Because when you open, like, any kind of, um, paint program nowadays, you've got, like, 50,000 brushes? Like, and you don't know what any of them look like. But I also have a, um, what are they called? Bodycoon? I have a bodycoon. I bought a bodycoon. Uh, it's a knockoff bodycoon that's like was 15. And I didn't want to pay like 30 for it, but it it's one of those gray art figures that like is an anime figure, but you can have him pose and you can give him like little shields and swords and cups and things and different hands and you can swap out and then you take pictures of it and then you can draw on it. I was hoping that on the Switch they'd come out with, like, new Art Academy games. Because you can draw on the Switch. There's a- there's a- it's called Colors. It comes with the stylus that you can draw on the Switch. With it. And I was hoping that they'd make an Art Academy game, but they didn't. You can also use it on your tablet or your phone. Since it uses the volume control for pressure, which is, is cool. And you can actually buy the stylus separately from the game. So even if you don't have like a super expensive iPad, you can buy like, a, I think it's $25. Uh, for like just the stylus, and it, it goes on any mobile device that you can that has a has a headphone port. So it will actually work on your iPhones and iPads, but it'll work on your Android devices. Then again, if you're using an iPad or iPhone, you're probably just going to buy the Apple stylus, Apple Pencil, and it it'll build the Apple Pencil will work better. Russian blue named light, Persian named Hana, and a Shih Tzu named Mew. Yeah, I was I was gonna get back into drawing and just the only way you get better at drawing is by drawing. And um drawing and using reference. Some people can just like spit out uh, a drawing without anything. I cannot. I will always be the pathetic poor person that has to draw a skeleton first. But just draw on anything, like a pencil, just do it in margins on any kind of paper, you know? I haven't been doing that because, well, I'm a, I'm a slacker. I'm a terrible slacker. <laughs> I'm 
We were in exam room three again, weren't we? Right though. Like, is this what is it? What was his name? Kagami Light from Death Note? Or is this Dr. Light from Mega Man? Oh, there's another light from another another game. Another game or another anime. I hate this one. It's like the cat moves its face. When you're right. I feel sad about about this. That was pathetic. But then again, I really hate the eyedrop one. Oh, that was like hard, no wonder. Yay. Oh no, splinters. Seven is the maximum you can get. All right, we're back to the cute ticks.
That's an entirely too long. Is this one of those, like, you start off thinking it's gonna be, like, just an easy kid game, and then, like... It actually takes gamer skills to do this one. So that would be kind of awesome, but at the same time, kind of... What are we doing to our children? <laughs> then again, honestly, when I was, like, eight... When I was around that age, I was better at video games than I am now. I actually decreased in skill, so maybe this is more my speed. Perfect timing. That's it. Everything ex went better than expected. First try, perfect timing. What's her name? Liz Lucidius? Lumi Lucidius? Muet? Choco Taco Hydro Puncher? Everything went better than expected. First try, perfect timing. Uh. Something Lilyhoof. Trying to remember her name because, like, I just, I just like it. And I think she's streaming? Maybe not. Maybe I just saw an old stream. I, I don't, I, I... You could tell my brain has, like, slid off reality into, I'm just saying words now. So it's not how you exactly sew up a wound. Then again, me sewing up a wound is holding it together and then just putting tape over it. I, I probably should not be a doctor. But then again, I think there is some kind of medical glue or medical tape that they use instead of like stitches they actually do tape you together but for me they just glued it together they just held it and just put some kind of i don't know glue over it and like you're good to go there's no stitches or anything you just we glued you up have a nice day and i'm like i don't trust this most of the glue stayed some of the bits like on my chest when I got my gallbladder out, some of those opened out. What I kind of did is just like I wetted the the the, the glue and I kind of re-glued it. Don't, don't, don't. 
31 more to level up. Oh yeah, that's right. That was a dog. I really need to put my throne on that one. Have all three of them together. So, it's like, I don't want to move and stuff on you because. Textures look really weird. I have this on FSR at double the uh, resolution. Alright, how do you give a dog a shot? You grab it by the scruff of its neck and you kind of like pinch it and then you just stab it in there. You kind of slide it in at like an angle. Unless it has to go in the arm. Pupper, I've got you. That was the last one we had in here, right? Eat with me! Now! Let's have lunch together. Wrong in my head. Noodles and vegetables. Well, at least you didn't quiz me about what the hell you're eating without any clues.
診察を始めましょうか For our dog, our dog just to rub her ear on the floor. Back to the cute fleas. Incredibly cute fleas. They're just so round and cute. knock at the door. I told everyone I'm not going to be out for dinner. You're actually not supposed to use Q-tips in the ear. Surprise, surprise. Actually supposed to put like some kind of oil in your ear and then like wash it out that way that's what my ear doctor told me You named your Chihuahua Tiger. wonder about these pet owners like seriously seriously you, you don't you're like yeah okay my dog got injured like the, the the eye is injured but then it's like you did nothing for the scrape you didn't notice that gently with both hands. Stroke gently with both hands. I forgot to mention I, I played Metarot, Metalot, Metabot, the first game that has a uh, English translation. And beat it. Everyone just needs to know that for some reason.
Uh, what do I think of the Metabot series? Metabot series. Ah, uh, I skipped it because it didn't have any pretty uh, robots in it, and I kind of feel I was correct. Like some of the end battles were just impossible. It didn't matter what combination of parts I put together. It just they just one shot. You're dead. And then finding out that I missed some stuff because, like... Because, like, you have to do things at certain times and, like... those games it's like once you get one thing done go back to every place you've been to before which is annoying because there's random battles random encounters and you don't get like the bike thing until later in the game and you're like okay well you know you fight people and you get their parts but like what you level up I'm a promising veterinarian. I'm no longer like a useless, hopeless veterinarian. But But it was just, okay, I fought this person a billion times, I've got like a billion of these parts that I've sold, which is how you get money, is that you sell them. Excuse me. Sprout noises. Okay, so... If they're up on the board, do they trust me a lot? Or if they're down on the board, they trust me a lot? Or are they just arranged on the board randomly? Alright, I need to talk to Naoto then. Like, it's one of those, you, you gotta get these people to trust you. It's a Niyatome game, you have to talk to the side characters because they'll stab you in the back if you don't. <laughs> Alright, I think I'm gonna call it here because I'm starting to feel the heat. The heat is on. Dun 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 I'll save it again, just to make sure I saved it the first time. Um... Anybody else streaming? Stramming today? You know what? Level Up Lumi is streaming. Let's go raid her. Because I was like... Saying her name. She's playing some... Just chatting. Propaganda. Propa Propagna. Asha. Okay, she's playing Monster World. Which is the uh, Monster World 3, which has the female protagonist. So. Let's go do that. Um, and you're going to hear her full name when we raid her because that's what she does. So. You can judge me on how, how well I remember it. Switch to powering down. 
Friend type? I pay you to only do one job. Switch to powering down. Powering down, Aruji-sama. All right, well, welcome, uh, welcome. Thanks, everybody, for coming. Uh, I, I enjoy you being here. Uh, I'll try to start streaming more regularly. Um, stay, uh, stay cool. Get plenty of water. Take care of yourselves. Uh, what, what else? I, I, I... My oh, brain's melted, sorry. So, I'll see everyone later if I missed everything. If I missed anything, sorry. Uh... But thanks. Thanks, Jamie. Alright, let's let me get let me get into the Ready to read three, two, one, go! 